they have a joyful song about the great things god has done what we have come to witness as we celebrate the feast of the visitation is the joyful experience of the presence of the holy spirit the spirit overshadowed mary she greeted elizabeth and elizabeth was filled with the holy spirit john the baptist leapt with joy they have a joyful song about the great things god has done later filled with joy zachariah also sings the praises of god this visitation brings all the promises of god into an experience of the beginning of completion john sleeping with joy is our joy too in the graciousness of god as the morning sun comes to visit us the lord has come to us to fulfill his promise of mercy the visitation reminds us about the presence of the kingdom of god ever near to us as the angel's announcement to mary mary's greeting makes us rejoice in the opening of god's kingdom every moment and event that we live in mary as a mother and intercessor helps us to grow in grace in order to remain fully open for the holy spirit to fill us with peace and joy mary as the type of the church visitation of mary shows clearly our role in being overshadowed by the holy spirit bearing the son of god in us being a person of the kingdom of god bearing a greeting of peace and joy as the mark of what we have received this visitation personally and as a church strengthens us to sing with mary her song of praise the almighty has done great things for me his mercy is for those who see all things in relation to the abounding goodness of god that indeed is the true cause of rejoicing those who find the grace welling up from within also finds the fill of hunger and thirst true justice and the rise of the lowly mary's visitation has brought the visitation of god into true experience may this day fill us with the presence of god may god fill us completely with the fullness of life that we may experience freedom so that in that freedom we may serve god all the days of our life in the presence of god in justice and in love